Hey you guys, your girl Weedy with Mika. So yes, I have two unboxings, but let's be clear. I bought these bags during Christmas time and I just haven't started to use them. And I was like, you know what? I'll bring them at the perfect time where things are starting to slowly open up. We want to rock our bags. So I also did find one of these bags is a dupe to the Louis Vuitton neoprene, which I was so excited about. But yeah, I bought these bags during Christmas time. Hubby bought one and then I bought the other. Um, as you guys know, I have a I sold a lot of my collection and I have some high-end stuff but again I went back to what's been good which is coach and I used to be a coach girl and now I'm starting to fall in love with coach's new creative director because he is making some things work so the first bag that hubby picked up for me was this one and I cannot wait to pit to just oh i'm so dying to get into this bag it is the pebble sg willow tote it's in the shade forest i am so in love with this color you guys can see it matches my nails i do not have a bag this color i am definitely getting away from bags that are black tan just black and tan so i love a bag with this color and whenever my office opens i could definitely go back to work with this bag i could travel with it i do like the arm extension i also like the security of the snap right here so this was on sale at macy's and it went down to like 110 dollars i'm not sure what the regular price is but i'll insert it and you guys know i'll do mod shots to show you guys what it looks like this has a full interior i love that it has the signature right here it does have padding this zipper so this zipper right here it has padding so it can fit a macbook if you have it an ipad or anything in here and it has its care thing so yeah love this bag this was one where it was like well you know he always likes to see which bags if I there's a bag that I'm interested in because he has access to my wish list. Girl, wish lists are the best thing in the world. <laughs> um, so I created a wish list and then he picked this up and I was so in love and I was so happy. Of course, it has my favorite color on the key tag. And I hope soon that uh, Coach can start doing hot prints on their bags like um, LV. I also love that it has the feet stamp. So as you guys know, I never put my purse on the floor. But obviously when it is like somewhere or even in the car, I do like the feet stamp because it keeps the shape to the back. Now this one did come with a dust cover, which I was surprised at because usually Macy's when you order from them, they don't have a dust cover in their bag, but they actually did send one. So I do like that. So this did come with the dust cover. So I was like on point, on point. All right. So another bag. This one is a dupe to the Louis Vuitton um, Neo bag. Now I did have the Neo in my wish list, and I was just like. <sighs> Like, you know, you, nah, you ain't even really got to go there. But when I did see this one, I actually bought this one. I bought my husband's Christmas gift and I was waiting for it to come in. Obviously, I was going to do a video. You guys already see, I gave you guys a vlog before I even showed you guys this. Didn't even mention it. And I remember I sent this to my sister and I was like, yo, tell me what you think about this bag. Because I ordered this one and the one in black. And I was like, I really want to get away from a black bag. But if I had to choose one, what would you keep? And me and her both were thinking the same idea. This one is such a dupe. When I explained to her how I was looking at it and I said it's a Louis Vuitton dupe, she automatically was like, yep, I already know which one. So this is what this one is. And I am so cute. I love this whole black and brown. I love the gold emblem on here. I love that it has this top handle and the strap and the strap is adjustable. It also does not have feet, which I am fine with, but I just love the sturdiness of it. I'm keeping the wrapping in here. Let me see if I can tell you guys what the name is. This is the Signature Twan Bucket Bag. It's regular price $398. I got it during Black Friday for $110. It's something about those Black Friday sales. So girl, I literally was like, boom i already seen it and i ordered two of them i did not keep the black one but i do like this one i feel like this one is like it's sexy it's grown it'll work all times of the year it stands out more the black one just seemed like it was just a regular black bucket bag to me that pretty much you can get anywhere i was like it just looks like it doesn't look any different than just if i went anywhere else and bought a black bucket bag so yeah this is what this looks like i haven't even took it off the wrapping but it has gold um accessories on it i like that the strap is black i think you could actually change the strap so even if i wanted to i could probably go to coach and get a black a brown strap to change out or i could take the strap off and just wear like bucket style it does have a closure in here so it has the closure button right here i kept all the insert in here to keep the shape of the bag 
and I'll show you guys it does have a middle zipper so it has a closure on this side and a closure on this side and it has a closure on each side so each side has a closure the stuffing keeps its shape but yeah this was one of those bags where when I ordered his Christmas gift I ordered this one and I was like oh yes so when it came in even when I showed my husband he was like yeah this one stands out like this is cute 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 so this one did not crazy thing is this one did not come with a dust cover so I actually keep a lot of my dust covers depending on the bag or you can go on Poshmark or Macari and you could just pay for a dust cover for like less than ten dollars and most of the time that's what I will do depending on the bags that I have so I actually pulled out a dust cover that I had and it just fit perfectly I was like I know I have a dust cover somewhere um so yeah that is it. I'm going to go ahead and include shots so you guys can see what this looks like. Again, remember I am 5'3", so this does stand very perfect on me. And let me know what you guys think. Let me know if there's any bags out. Let me know. I don't really plan to purchase luxury this year, to be honest, because I just feel like with everything going on, where am I going to be rocking my luxury handbags? I need something that's going to be crossbody, convenient, easy to go with, unless I'm traveling. And I don't know when I'm going to travel again. So... Go ahead, thumbs up, comment, like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Stay blessed. Bye.